What's up Rebels, it is Chunky Monkey Ford here and today, well, we got a lot to talk about. Shout out to John Daly. So first of all, today marks nine years that I've been doing YouTube. I started my channel April 13th, 2015. We're pushing 35,000 subscribers right now and I just gotta say thank you guys so much. It really means a lot to me. I pour my heart and soul into all of these videos for you guys and the support just means the world. And speaking of new videos, I got something cool coming up. So I am going to Rock the Country. If you don't know what Rock the Country is, Rock the Country is the festival that Kid Rock and Jason Aldean are putting on in seven different cities across seven states. It's mostly down south. They just did the first one last weekend in Gonzales, Louisiana. It was That was really cool. I mean, it was Hank Williams Jr., Uncle Cracker, Big and Rich, Gretchen Wilson, Tucker Carlson actually opened up for Kid Rock. That was pretty cool. And Theo Vaughn opened for Hank Jr. That that was pretty sweet too. I don't know if any of that type of stuff is going to be happening at the Ashland show, but I'm going to be there. And dude, I am so excited for it. So the lineup for Ashland, Kentucky, I got it right here. It's on my uh, Snoop Dogg for Scribbles notepad. <laughs> but so the lineup on April 19th and 20th is Kid Rock, Jason Aldean, Miranda Lambert, Brantley Gilbert, Travis Tritt, Nelly, Gavin Adcock, LV Shane, Sadie Bass, and DJ Silver. And man, I am so fucking hyped. I've been getting ready for this the last few months. It's gonna be cool. I haven't seen Kid Rock since uh, 2022. The last show of his that I saw was at, uh, yeah, it was Pine Knob 2022 in uh, Clarkston, Michigan. That was a great show. That was on the Bad Reputation Tour. I didn't get to go see him last year at the Little Caesars Arena. I don't like going down to Detroit. But this is gonna be cool because it's out in a small town. And not only that, it's a festival. And so there's nine other stars on the lineup that I'm gonna get to see alongside Kid Rock. Like I've never seen any of these guys on the list. I'm mostly excited to see Jason Aldean, Miranda Lambert, Brantley Gilbert, and Travis Tritt, uh, Nelly, Gavin Ad Adcock, LV Shane's gonna be pretty sick. He's got that song, Connie Rhodes. That's a good song. But it's gonna be fun, and I'm gonna be there with the camera. I'll be filming everything. Well, not everything, because of copyright issues, I can't show the concerts. I'm gonna show as much as I can of them. I'm definitely gonna get some cool B-roll clips, and I'm general admission, so I'm not gonna be front row. Buying a VIP ticket would have been badass, but that's just not in the budget for me this year but it's gonna be cool I look forward to meeting so many of you guys there and if you see me walking around feel free to come up and say hey that's one of my favorite things to do when I go out to these events is get to meet the people like Hazard Fest for example Hazard Fest uh, last year I did that video talking with fans that was like one of my favorite videos that I did from that whole thing just getting to hang out with people talk to them and you know hear like what videos they've seen of mine or this one I'm gonna do a little bit different I'm gonna talk more about the festival I'm gonna ask some funny questions it's gonna be a good time and I really look forward to getting you guys in the video so I know I got a lot of friends in the Kid Rock fan base mainly in the uh, Kid Rock crazy uh, Facebook group shout out to y'all yeah it's gonna be a good time you know and I'll be repping pretty much this is what I'm gonna be wearing at the festival I might wear the other high-class white trash hat which by the way I'm a brand ambassador for high-class white trash guys go get yourself some merch they got some really cool stuff up on the website now they've got stickers they've got shirts flags hats I mean check this hat out y'all like my new haircut <laughs> Shout out to my mama. She cuts my hair. From a distance, it looks like it might say Make America Great Again, but really it's just high class white trash. If you look on the back, it says, fuck Joe Biden. You can shop High Class White Trash down in my description. There's my brand ambassador link down there. A lot of cool stuff. Oh, I'm going to wear this one for the rest of the video. We'll switch it up. <laughs> this one's one of my favorite hats, though. I love this one with the American flag on the back and then the Kingsford style logo on the front. That's fucking sweet. But anyways, my plan for Rock the Country, though, is basically I just want to show the whole experience. Because I know there's a lot of people who want to go to this, but because of the terrible economy right now, not a lot of people are going to be able to go. So I'm going to do my best best to capture the full experience in like a 20 minute YouTube video. I've done it before with a lot of other things, you know, mainly Dukes of Hazard stuff. As you can see, I'm a quite a big Dukes of Hazard fan for those newcomers to the channel. But I'm very excited for this. It's going to be something out of the box for me, something a little different, but it's also not, you know. It's right up my alley, and I, I, there's going to be a lot of Patriots there. It's going to be a very patriotic thing. In fact, actually, I think the day one is Patriot-themed, and then day two is, like, all, like, camo, and it's, like, duck calls and overalls. Uh, duck calls and overalls, that's it. And that's going to be pretty cool. I don't know what I'll wear that day, but I know I'm going to wear this for Patriot Day, pretty much. I'll probably wear the other hat. I'm not sure. This hat's pretty comfy. It's going to be a lot of fun, man. I'm just so excited for it, as you can tell by this video. I just wanted to turn my camera on and say hey to everybody on YouTube, because today is a special day day to me. I mean, I started my YouTube channel nine years ago and YouTube's been my life ever since then pretty much. And it's crazy to think that 
I've been doing this for almost half my life. It's fucking crazy. I'm 21 years old, gonna be 22 this year, so that's pretty crazy. But yeah, if you enjoyed videos like the Hazard Fest stuff or the top 10 best patriotic anthems from Biden's horrible presidency, which is one of my favorite videos, both of them are. But if you enjoyed those videos or my Hazard Fest videos, imagine those two videos coming together. And that's basically what I'm gonna do for Rock the Country. And not only will I be videoing the experience and talking with the fans, but I'm also gonna be talking with some of the people there at at the festival. Now I don't know who yet, but I do know that like companies like Old Row are gonna be there. I'd like to go talk to some of those guys and hear about their brand because they make some really cool stuff. And a couple other things too, you know, who knows what's gonna happen. I'm going in there basically blind. I don't know much of anything about it other than who's on the lineup. And so it'll be just as much of a raw experience for me as it will be for everybody watching the video. And it should be a good time. I'll video the whole trip going down there, hoping and praying my 2002 Ford makes it down there. <laughs> I think it will though. I I think it will. It's a little rusty. It's got a couple issues in the front end, but you know what? We're just gonna fucking send it and hope for the best. And then as for the rest of the channel, I know I've been pretty inactive lately after the uh, 45 Years of Duke special that I did with John Schneider. If you guys missed that, you gotta go check it out. It's fucking awesome. I know I haven't uploaded shit ever since then, but that's because I've been working on a lot of different stuff behind the scenes. I've done some commission work. I photographed a wedding. That was pretty cool. Been doing some video work here and there on the side, but I haven't done much YouTube videos lately. That's because I've been planning some pretty big stuff. You know, obviously we've got Lee Six, the sixth General Lee ever built. That's a video that I shot back at the Volo Museum when I was there for the Stand Up General series. That video is in the works and it's coming very soon. But I've also been working on bringing some new stuff into Chunky Monkey, like Yellowstone, Trailer Park Boys. Obviously you got Kid Rock and Donald Trump, you know. After the Patriotic Anthems video blew up like it did, I've really wanted to do more political videos and so I've been doing a lot of research on that and I'm working on some pretty cool stuff for that. But right now my focus is just getting ready for Rock the Country, finishing up my commission work so that then when I get back home, all I gotta worry about is just rocking the country. Oh, and the other thing too. There's gonna be a new series coming soon to the YouTube channel that's gonna be called Chunky's Customs. I don't really wanna say too much about it, but I guess I'll show you this. If you guys know Trailer Park Boys, then you sure as shit know this car. This is the Shipmobile. This is the car that Ricky, Bubbles, and Julian drive around on Trailer Park Boys all the time. And I'm gonna get into making some of these and you're gonna see it on video. Make some other Hot Wheels cars too that I think you guys will enjoy, among other things as well. There's gonna be another documentary coming soon that's gonna be on a very big country star that made headlines in February. That's all I'll say there. It's gonna be a wild year, to say the least. But Rock the Country is just going to be sweet. And I'm so looking forward to it. Getting to see all my Kid Rock friends. I mean, I've, this banner actually is from Kid Rock's fourth annual fish fry. I competed in the hood slide competition. In fact, I got to check this shit out. So I competed in Kid Rock's hood slide competition, even though I did a terrible hood slide. I pretty much did a hood jump. I cleared the fucking General Lee. <laughs> I was so nervous being up on the stage. I wish I could go back and do a good one. But uh, yeah, that was pretty cool. That was a fun day. But uh, I competed in that and I made these koozies. Chunky Monkey 40 for Hood Slide Champion. A fan made me this banner. I think it was Trish. I'm pretty sure Trish made that banner. Yeah, I love this thing though. It's pretty cool. But, yeah, so many folks that I've known for years are going to be there. And I, folks that I haven't seen in years. So I'm very looking forward to going and seeing everybody. And for any of you guys watching who would like to help support me along the journey, and get this video made because it's a pretty expensive concert and it's going to be a pretty expensive trip. Financially, if I'm being totally honest, financially I sh probably shouldn't be going, but I was able to make it happen, barely, but we're going to do it. Just fucking send it and hope for the best. But if you guys would like to help support me along the way, again, High Class White Trash is linked down below in the description. You can go get some of their merchandise or I have my own merchandise at ChunkyMonkey40.com. Got some cool Kid Rock stickers on there. You got the Donald Trump and Kid Rock American Badasses stickers. Those I just recently made. We got Stay Rebel, Orange Cars Matter, and they call me the general because I generally don't give a fuck. Those stickers and koozies are on there too. If you want to keep your beverage cold, get yourself a koozie. Our koozies are made in America by the koozie company and made by High Class White Trash. It was a collaboration between me and Brian who runs High Class White Trash. But all that stuff's on my website and then High Class White Trash has got their own stuff and it's fucking badass. And it's high quality too. I mean this shirt, I've literally worn this every single week for two years now. It's high class and it's white trash. It's fucking perfect. Stay tuned for my vlog from Rock the Country. You might be seeing this on Facebook or Instagram or somewhere like that, but all the Rock the Country videos will be uploaded to youtube.com slash chunkymonkey40, so go check them out when they're out. I'm hoping to get the videos out within a week or two. 
of Rock the Country. But with all that said and out of the way, I am ChunkyMonkey40 at YouTube.com. Stay rebel, y'all, and keep on generally not giving a fuck. Next time you see me, I'll be down in Kentucky rocking the country. <laughs> Just some good old boys. Never meaning no harm. It beats all you ever saw. Been in trouble with the law since the day they was born. They straighten them curves. They flatten them heels. Well, someday the mountain might get them, but the law never will.